the esteemed uh, uh, people. First, we have uh, Frank Burns. Frank, welcome. Welcome. Uh, you why don't you introduce yourself and your, your title? Okay. Um, my name is Frank Third Degree Burns. I go by jollydwarf.com. I, uh, I'm at maintenance in Bordentown, New Jersey, and also um, I do bachelor parties, birthday parties. I get uh, dwarf toss and midget bowling, you know. And also I'm deputy mayor of George City. That's excellent. And uh, you collect the salary for that? Yes, I get 10%, um, you know, plus and, you know. Isn't it true there's 12 deputy mayors of Jersey City? Yes, there is. There's one. His name is the Giant Jolly Jolly Giant. Here's another deputy mayor. How you doing? Uh, yes, my name sir. is Sean Rooney. I'm the deputy mayor of, of Jersey City. And uh, I'm here with two other deputy mayors of Jersey City. And to my left is Beetlejuice. I'm the next mayor. Lester Green, I'm the deaf mayor. You know, a lot of so taxpayers <laughs> would I'm be worse. I'm the test mayor, so you got to learn that. I do all the work. Everything's going to do. Anybody get paid? Now, you're the supervisor of the deputy yeah, mayor's of Jersey I'm the City. Def, I'm the deputy mayor. So what do, what do you do? I do lots of things. Now, wait I'll, a minute. I help people out. I got restaurants. They do things. They help me out. Pizza place. Now, there's a whole and lot of deputy mayors. And they do what they got to do. A lot of people would say there's too many deputy mayors, that these are just plum political jobs. I mean, did you feel that way? Yeah. <laughs> I really do. How about, how about you, Deputy Mayor Rooney? I feel the same way, as, as does Beetlejuice. Uh, you know, we feel there's too many deputy mayors out there, especially in Jersey City. Yeah. Uh, but this is our supervisor, Deputy Mayor. Well, do you put the money back into the community? Well, we put it back into the community, yes, but mostly they're bars that we put it back into. Uh, me, myself, Beetlejuice, and the Jolly Dwarf, we like to frequent a lot of bars in Jersey City. That's and how uh, we, that's yeah. how we put back into the community. That's we, excellent. We take out of the community, but we put back you in. You spend money to make money. Exactly. Yeah. Do, do you guys ever show up to work? Once in yeah, a while we show up, yeah. yeah. You know. Election day? Election day only, yeah. That's you, the only day we'll show up. You must have the corner on... Uh, I don't know what the politically correct word is for little people. Yeah. Yeah, little people of America. I, uh, I, I, and... Now, Frank, what was your slogan? You were telling me beforehand that you had a slogan. Matter of fact, Sunday you were telling me. Sun yeah. And in front of my office, you said, I have a slogan, so I'm concerned about taxes. Well, I like to get, uh, see, a lot of these big guys, this guy right has paid full tax. Right. And I think little people like us, we should pay. pay. Half the tax. That's only fair. But you should, know, you, should you get that pay at price? It, that means you should get at least a salary or double, right? Yeah. And right, exactly. Excellent. Yeah. Uh, do what is what do you see the future of Jersey City? How do you see it? I see it's getting cleaner. Um, get cleaner? It's better, I guess. Okay. Just by me being there. Everybody knows me now. Being in that state pack state parade. That's excellent. You know, and uh, everybody looks up. I. They better look up to me now, you know. So when the taxpayer opens up their tax bill, they should say, well, at least we got three darn good deputy mayors. We got it. Exactly. Yes, sir. Thank you, Frank. And especially yeah, yeah. our supervisor. He makes sure yeah. everything goes right. He's the guy who... Can we call you Superman? Okay. I'm the Superman. The I Superman? do everything. Sorry about that. Hey, yeah. I'm the super guy. I do everything. No. I make sure everything is all right. I make sure everything is cool. Now, uh, Sean, you were uh, the St. Anthony star, isn't that right? Yeah, I played for St. Anthony's uh, 86 through 90. It, did Beetlejuice play with you? <laughs> yeah, he was the starting center. <laughs> Beetlejuice, center. Uh, how, how did huh? you do? Hitting center. He was the hitting center. Hitting center? Yeah. How, how, does that, how does that experience help you with being a deputy mayor of Jersey City? Because I'm the only guy who was in Jersey City. You know? I've been doing this for 12 years. Seven years. I've been the mayor for all years. That's excellent. That's excellent. I've been doing this for 19 years. It's excellent. Um, and do you think uh, Jersey City's improving? Yeah. Really cool guys and nice guys. Uh, to my left is 
a man that has only been <laughs> introduced to me as Beetlejuice. <laughs> they will not give me his name. <laughs> to his left is a, a, a good friend of mine, a good person, uh, Sean Rooney. Now, Sean has been on uh, the uh, Letterman Show, and, um, uh, the Howard Stern Show. And uh, Sean, you work with uh, a couple of... <laughs> A couple of uh, uh, people. Um, you're, you're involved in something a little bit controversial, yeah. and, and we're going to talk about that in a minute and the reasons you do that. Um, and, and we're going to ask uh, <laughs> Mr. Beetlejuice. <laughs> he makes me laugh every time he stares at me because he's. I feel like I'm getting stared down. He gets me nervous. But uh, <laughs> but he's a cool guy, so I got Sean backing me up here. Yeah. Anyway. Um, Sean, let's talk a little bit about your life. You were a, a big star for St. Anthony's basketball team. Okay. And uh, what was that like? <laughs> you were you were <laughs> you were an MVP. What what years are we talking? <laughs> what years are we talking about? <laughs> I don't remember. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Mr. Beetlejuice. <laughs> What you gotta say, man. Okay. You're, you're, uh, you're, uh, uh <laughs> I'm sorry. We're, you're, you're, a little bit, you're a little bit smaller than the, than the average man. Let's, let's put it that way. I'm a little fatter than the average man, a little bit bolder, but you're a little bit smaller. Um, have you found that, uh, to be a, a discriminator in your life? Have you found that to be a, a cause of pain or, or trouble in your life? You just don't care. <laughs> you just don't care. Everything's cool. Okay. <laughs> All right. Yeah, this is great. Um, All right. You're involved in some controversial, which is you, you get tossed for a living. And it's how you make your living. Yeah. Now, a lot of people say, including some people that are, are small in stature, they say, hey, you know, physically small, I mean mentally small, hey, you know, uh, that um, dehumanizes us. That makes us less than what we are. You know, we're decent human beings. You're putting us down on, on a lower level. You know, what would you say to those people? Well, I tell them, hey, I don't mind doing it. I do it anyway. It don't make no difference, but I do it. So your attitude basically is that, um, you know, you're a, you, you have a deformity like everybody else does, and you, you're going to use it for entertainment just like anybody would, like Jerry Lewis would when he was, you know, a skinny guy or or, uh, you know, Kojaki of the bald head or, you know, whatever, whatever actor, uh, you know, um, uh, I think Peter Falk had a one eye, you know, and he used that in his career. And you're going to use your, uh, you have a your more physical stature, you're going to use that, you know, to, to entertain people to make money. And that's basically the bottom line. Well, I use it, but I do it, though. Well, it don't make, it don't make no difference, but that's I cool. do it anyway, you know. That's cool. People, I make people happy. I scare them, make them happy. And you, you like know? that? You like making people happy? Yeah. yeah. Frank is a fan. Okay, we're back with Beetlejuice and Sean Rooney. Uh, at this time, um, Beetlejuice is going to get thrown. Uh, before he gets thrown, I, I want uh, Sean and Beetlejuice to know that uh, Sean and Beetlejuice are our official uh, small person's uh, handlers and our official small person. Uh, and Although Frank is also an official small person, too. So I guess you're both official small people for the Liberty Civic Association. Congratulations, and thanks for coming. And now, without further ado, Mr. Rooney is about to throw um, Mr. Beetlejuice. Uh, do your thing. Wow. It was almost like Superman. <laughs> 